half first edition, a new edition, brand new Charles Sport on Sunday. And I do, I hope you guys are having fun because soon we shall open the lines and all things we've talked about. And also, you have opportunity to speak to my guests who are now in the house. Like I said, before the All Africa Games, uh, I went there to watch him and his colleagues there, you know, for the, the, the trials. And I noticed something about him because when we brought him here for the first interview, I said, normally when amateur boxers fight, they don't go for the body, they go for the head. And then I watched him going for the body. I mean, this is, this is, this is kind of a pro. You know, you know, already there, the thinking, probably is the upbringing, probably is, I don't know how long he was boxing before he got all there. Uh, um, and later on, of course, that was, he, he went to All-Africa Games and came back, that was history, went to the U.S. and turned pro. And uh, during that, we also got, got caught up, it was uh, someday at the National Stadium, I met the father, and then they were, you know, found out that, you know, you're organizing clinics, organizing, picking kids, having tournaments and stuff like that. I go, yeah, let's see it. And then we got talking, he was here. And then we got to that. There is a lineage, uh, a history, you know, of boxing. Uh, uh, but then I didn't get this. Uh, you, sometimes somebody keeps blowing your mind. And then the National Sport Festival came in, and I saw some boxers there. And I saw it all year later. Who is this? The same family. But this time around, that is, that is the bang. That is the bomb. Because I tell you this. Now, we're talking about Gloria. Uh, as she is here for the first time with them, I want to start. I want us to meet the Oyeleye families, and we start from the, the, the queen in the boxing family. Gloria, how are you? I'm fine, sir. Talk well, talk well. Mm -hmm. How are you doing? Fine. Fine. Mm, you went to the National Sport Festival? Yes, sir. You got to the quarter final. Yes. Just one more, you would have gotten the bronze. How is it like being a boxer? Mm. You like boxing? Yes. You like boxing? Yes. You are not afraid that this is your pretty face. Somebody will just punch it for you. You are not afraid? Yes. <laughs> okay. All right, that, that's Gloria. And then, okay, let's meet. Uh, uh, Coach has been here before. Uh, uh, he is the father of Gloria. He is the father of Femi. Uh, uh, Coach Abayo, me, you You welcome to this program. Welcome. It's a pleasure having us in the studio. You must be a proud father. Yeah. God. <laughs> it's God. It's <laughs> how, how old was Gloria when, she, when you started putting gloves in her hands? And she started when she was, let's say, 10 years. Okay. Yeah, 10 years. That time we were in Maiduguri. Okay. Mm, because they, they were born in Maiduguri. They were all, all, they were all born in Maiduguri? Yeah, they were born in Maiduguri. Because I know Femi also was born in Maiduguri. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm, I'm working for the sport council there, it, but the British Borneo Sport Council. Yeah. yeah so that's where they are, they are born in Maiduguri. Okay. Yeah, we'll come back to you. Let us welcome Femi back. Femi, yeah. welcome to the show. Pleasure to be here, sir. Yeah, you fought last weekend. Yeah. Uh, that was uh, that was your what, what number of your professional fights have you fought now? My ninth professional fight. Your ninth professional fight, and then Femi is what nine? Nine and all. Nine and all. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. When he say nine and all, he <laughs> means nine zero. He means yeah. he fought nine, won nine, drew none, lost none. Yeah. So it's nine and all. The other all. Uh, 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 okay. Let's. I, uh, I, I want to take it. Uh, you know, bit by bit. Uh. Mm. Coach, I'm calling you coach now. Yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah. These, are, these are your kids. Yeah, and yeah. then uh, they are all there into the uh, uh, roped yeah. square or the squared rope, the way Americans yeah. are calling it these days. Yeah. When we're growing up, it is, we call it the roped square. Yeah, you yeah. know, where the Muhammad Ali's and the Joe Frizas were yeah, fighting. Yeah. But right now, they say it is squared rope. I'm still yeah, finding, uh, you know, which, which one is there. You know, you, you've been in boxing for how long? Mm, I started boxing in the year 1980 at Rope Park Sports Center. 1980. 1980. Okay. Then um, I represented Lagos State in the 1985 at National Sport Festival. Oh, Kuara oh. 85, where I won a bronze medal. I lost to James, James Moses. Okay. James of Niger State. All right. Mm. Okay. Mm. So, so we are seeing a pattern. We are seeing a pattern. The father <laughs> went, 1985 was at the National Sport Festival, and he got a bronze. Okay, Femi. Uh, uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's come to you. At what point did your father say, wear gloves? Were you the one that said you want to start boxing, or okay. your father that said you should start boxing? Actually, I started boxing uh, as a self-defense. Okay. I was bullied when I was six years old. I think it, a girl beat me up. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> a so, girl beat <laughs> him up! <laughs> so my okay. mom didn't like that. I was getting beat by a girl. So yeah. When I got home, she's like, oh, your dad has to train you. Yeah. I started boxing as a self-defense, but... It, they, it then became part of me. I couldn't stop. You couldn't stop? Yeah. I started boxing at, I think, 99. 
2000. So, okay. Yeah. So your your you know you know your your daddy your daddy came back and he now said, Daddy, I want to be a boxer. Yeah. And then he too, when he said he wants to be a boxer, he didn't say, look, this is my pretty son. What do you mean? No, he, my, my dad think I'm so lazy, I can be a boxer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, no, 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 there, there is something here. Uh, I, 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 when we open the lines, we want to get maybe some boxing fans out there, you know, uh, uh, to join this conversation, if possible. Um, he said he was beaten up by a girl. Does that ring a bell for those of you who follow boxing? Uh, there used to be the guy who says, you know, uh, uh, my name is Mohammed Ali. Short foreman can do nothing. Joe Freezer can do nothing. I float like a butterfly and sting like a bee. I tell you this. But he was not floating like a butterfly and stinging no, like a bee when he like was anything. beaten and his bicycle was taken away from him. That was the genesis. You know, he was going with his bicycle and a bully got to him and beat him up and took his bicycle. He ran to the policeman and to, 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 to complain. And the man said, what? They don't like to collect the bicycle. Come. And don't, don't, don't worry. We'll take it down. And that policeman took Muhammad Ali. Then Cassius Clay. You understand? Uh, at the Louisville Leap, that's when he was called in, and took him to the to a gym. And from then on, we have the I am the greatest. If not that somebody took his bicycle, you wouldn't have been the greatest. <laughs> so if not that somebody a lady beat you up, I mean you wouldn't have there. So I thought, you know, you 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 took from there on, how did you, you know you from there you went into the national camp? How did you went to go into the camp, national camp? Oh, I fell in love with uh, boxing after that time. I my improvement was very fast. Okay. So I went to a junior game at 16. I was the zonal champion, and I went on to be in, uh, the national champion. Oh, that one at Medigree? Yes. Okay. I, I later became national champion. Okay. A junior national champion uh, a few years later. So, okay. And then became national champion at senior category. So those are my like, uh, those are the drive that that I had. Those okay. are what really made me box because I had early achievements in boxing. Okay. Uh, were you at any of the national sport festivals? Yes, I was. My first national sport festival was. Uh, Kada Games 2009 in Kaduna. Kaduna, okay. Yeah, I won, I won silver medal. Okay. I lost to the national champion at that time. Yeah. Okay, so so I, I've just said to that part, I wanted to be sure of that, that the father fought, was at the national sponsor in 1985. He was there in Kada, you know, uh, uh, to, uh, Kada Games 2009. 2009. And then here is Glera, the baby of the family, also right there in Abuja 2018. Okay, so let's come to you. You are in school. You are in school. Uh, which, which school is that? Amzat Integrity College. Amzat Integrity College. Uh, I, you, I hope when your teachers want to flog you, you don't set blues for them. No. So, 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 how, so how, do you, how, how do you combine your boxing? How, how many hours do you train you know, in, a, in a week? or in a, Do you train daily or weekly? How do you train? Sometimes weekly. Okay. Well, sometimes daily. Sometimes daily. Uh, uh, you, your, 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 your dad set out you know, a training uh, schedule for you yes. that you are following. And then, uh, okay, in, in your, let, let me, let me uh, in, your, your, in your gym, there are also some female boxers. I did your, your little kids were into boxing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see Africa, we lay here. Okay. She's a primary school boxing champion. When she won, uh, she, won she won champion in the year, uh, two years ago, three years ago, at least, at least, at a national, at a Ropax Sports Center. Okay. Well, now she, she's now in secondary school. Okay. Mm, now she she won she won she won twice now at Shah Dignity Boxing Foundation in National Stadium. Okay. She won gold medal. She also won won gold medal. Two at, of them, at the, two of them won gold medal. Okay. At least in, in it is on December. December. Okay. Don't worry, because she's fourth. she's here. She's here. <laughs> okay. The, 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 tell us that because what will come to let, tell us about you know uh, from where you took to boxing. What what you know what tournaments you've been to. What have been your highs and your lows. What I think you enjoyed most. What I think that what the day you have cried. Have you ever cried after a fight and stuff like that? Then just you know, tell us, speak well, speak well. You have a lot of fans now. They're listening to you. Oh yeah, God. Yes, I've cried a lot. You've cried a lot. Yes. Okay. What makes you, what makes you cry when you when you win or when you lose? When I lose. You don't like losing. 